Oh no, what's going on? I knew it. <laughs> Ready to go buy a new car? I don't know anymore. <laughs> Stuntman Evan reporting for duty. You gotta try this thing. I'm scared. Oh, it is fantastic. Today we're going down to Houston, Texas, and I'm picking up the, uh, actually the rarest car that I've ever purchased. You guys thought, oop. Uh-oh. Evo 3 is definitely one of the coolest cars. Probably one of my favorite in the collection so far. They only made 360 of these cars in yellow. This car that I'm picking up today, they made only 200 of. It's really cool because it's an iconic lineup just like this car. It was literally a neck-to-neck -neck car. Rally, the RS, that just that kind of glorious, those glorious, beautiful days that we don't have anymore. So, let's we'll load up, go to H time. <laughs> I gotta make a racetrack in here. <laughs> no. No, you don't. <laughs> Road trip, baby. Monster, check. Hat, check. You wonder why I always wear a hat? Because Texas is too hot and humid, and my hair always falls down by the end of the day. You ever just heard, turn it up again. You ever, <laughs> you ever heard this song before? <laughs> <laughs> Two hours later. Taryn just had her first Houston experience. <laughs> Show us the type of wheels you just saw. <laughs> oh, you had to look at those Houston wheels, and that's the, that's literally the first picture that comes oh, up. Oh man, listen, Houston, I love you, and I know y'all are my brother city, but y'all do it too different down here. Let's go. <laughs> Oh, nice. Okay, we are at Oishi. Oishi, which means, Jaren told me that means delicious. Yeah, about, about that. It's about that. It's, 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 it's pretty, close to yeah, it. it can be a rough translation. In many terms, but delicious is was a good one. All right, let's go. Ooh, what's up, brother? Oh, dude, this thing's clean. I don't know if it is. What's up, Jesse? This is Jesse. Hey, Blizzard. Oishi. Oishi Imports. Who's is this? It's his. This is Yours? an actual Vertex Chaser. Woo! That is tight. Yeah, let's go see it, dude. Cool. Let's go check it out. So Oishi is uh, just started and still building. So this is where they're holding their cars right now. And I just want to see mine so bad. All right, I'm not going to lie. This thing's pretty cool right here. <laughs> 33 GTR. Oh, man, this GTR is nice. Ooh, I see mine. That's just mission. It's missing like a 50 cal machine gun sticking out the back. Dude, I'm so yeah. excited. She is. All right, guys. So, well, I'll show you a little more when we bring it outside. This is one of the coolest things ever. This is a real version one STI, but I had to go OG for the boys. This is an STI wagon. <laughs> Here we are. Oh my gosh. Dude, so I love GC8s and obviously I, I did just buy another sedan, but I started talking to Jesse and he said he had one of these and I was like, dude, I gotta have it. Because not only do I love the wagons and stuff, but I really, really like, I mean, it is, it's an STI. So here's what's cool about this. This is a one, let's see, this is, it's numbered. This car is number 168 out of 200 made. And I did do a little bit of research. It, to my knowledge, they did a, like maybe three runs of this. This was one of the 200, and then I think they did another one that was 100, and then maybe another one that was 100 or something like that. But this is one of 200 of this run. And I'm not exactly sure, I don't know, Jesse, I don't know if you know, but I don't know if they were all hatchback in all the runs, but. I know that they did make a sedan as yeah. well as a hatchback. And their difference in the VIN code as well. The uh, sedans are GC8s and these are actually GF8s. GF8s, GF. F for fat yeah. booty. <gasps> this is awesome. Um, and this has the EJ20G, which is, it's a strong, strong boy. I think they're closed deck. Yes, and they also had forged pistons as the SCI as well. Oh, you know, they're a little more oh. fortified motors. I like that, I like that. That sounds pretty good to me. Honestly guys, as much as I wanted to show you guys this, I wanna drive it. We're gonna take it for a spin, Jaren. You ready? That sounds good. You ready? Oh, I've been waiting for this. I love you too. I love you too, you're still in my heart. In classic Japanese fashion, one of these unlocks the front door, one of these unlocks the passenger door, and one of these Perfect. 
I'll one of these two is the ignition. <laughs> okay, I I'll figure out which yeah. one it is. Kakimoto, yeah, right? Yeah, Kakimoto Titanium. Ooh. And then we took out the silencer for you. We can throw it again. Yeah, Good. No, we don't need no silencer. Yeah. We don't need that. <laughs> How is this, Jen? This is pretty cool. This is pretty cool? <laughs> this is pretty cool. Oh my God, look, it's STI. You're going back it's to a, your This roots. is a real, S yeah, <laughs> exactly. It's a real Nardi STI steering wheel. I'll have to get this recarboned. This thing's pretty mint, like the dash, oh, you no cracks. See it. Yeah, I gotta turn the brightness up, but it's, it's all in Japanese. Perfect. That's pretty good. <laughs> That's pretty good. I'm so happy right now. So it's got STI, it should have STI seats. It says <laughs> it STI behind me. <laughs> there you go, yeah. You're, you're not as big as me. We've got some super authentic Japanese music. I am freaking stoked. Four door, so Gabriella can sit back there someday. I don't know what, I don't I don't know what know that what goes that to. Is, but it's a little Japanese remote. So I bought this car, I think a day after uh, I bought the other GC8, but he, he sent me this and it was one of those things where I just couldn't refuse. I had no reason to buy it, but I also had no reason to not buy it. But it this is way cooler than the WRX that I have. Even the WRX that I have is mint. It's cool, manual and stuff. This thing's, all right, ready to take it for a rip. Power engaged. AC off, power on. But uh, having the, the F chassis, the hatchback, like that's my roots, bro. I freaking love this car so much. I feel bad about not knowing, but the more you know. And I'm sure a lot of you guys out there might not have known that these existed. I had to do a lot of digging whenever Jesse did initially show this to me because I did see that it has STI badging on it. It had an STI stuff all over the VIN. Um, stuff in the engine bay, STI everywhere. I was like, I wanna, I wanna verify that this is a real STI. And I did look it up. And if it was an STI from this year, it was numbered because it was the version one. It, it's, it's just like, it's. This is so cool. This is such a cool car. <laughs> this thing is actually impressively quick. That this is. My Evo now is gonna be way faster than this because I just did the turbo upgrade, but this feels almost as, because it's so such a light car, it feels like it could be as fast as like the Subaru hatchback that I had back in the day. Don't you love this rumble, Jaren? That's nice. That little, that, <laughs> that rumble, ah! <laughs> yes, we drove, uh, we drove down to Oishi to pick this car up and finally bring it home. I'm, I'm stoked to just do some really clean stuff on this car and to be completely frank with you, probably just drive it around all the time. <laughs> this is amazing. <laughs> I'm like, look at this. All oh. of this random stuff, all this Japanese right here that I'll never be able to read. I wish I could. See, they didn't they didn't give <laughs> so a damn nervous. about how you thought you looked back in the day. You didn't it's hop in nervous. here to go on a date. You hopped in here to go race. That's true. <laughs> <laughs> yeah. I guess I'll just start going over some of the really cool stuff uh, that's on it. One of the first things I noticed out of the pictures is it's got some, I don't know how to pronounce this, but I, I, I've noticed the wheels because these are pretty cool OG three pieces. These are Madi 
Napers, I want to say. That's how you pronounce it. I'm going to actually respect these wheels. These are 16s right now. I'm going to respect them up to probably a 17 and uh, do a step flip on them uh, because these are pretty OG. Or I'll get, I don't know, we'll, we'll, we'll figure it out. I got lots to, lots to think about. Lots to do, but uh, that's pretty cool. Comes with some nice OG three-piece wheels. Something cool about this car is like, okay, so this is like the most 90s thing ever, this WRX. <laughs> it's honestly, oh, thank you so much. This is this decal is like the most 90s thing ever, and I love it. If you go to the show, it's called Radwood. That is the epitome of <laughs> That, and then um, this is like the double wing is nice. Obviously, you guys see that I have some, uh, some detailing to do. I might be able to actually work my magic and get some of that out. This The Evo is actually kind of yeah. like this in a lot of places. The, the color you got the Evo, I'm still like astounded by that you're able to make that the way it is. Your boy could probably work some magic here. Might have to repaint a couple things, but um, I'm so This car is so sick. Another thing is there's a Kakimoto, so this is a, this actually is a tie. A titanium. I believe it's a titanium axle back, yes. Damn, dude. So Kakimoto, it already sounds good. What we'll probably do is get a, a Link ECU for this thing, up boost a little bit, maybe try and throw this thing on E85, um, make it a little snappier and, and, and quicker, but uh, this thing is gonna be so perfect as it is. I'm also, so weird thing about these cars right now is GC8 parts are super hard to find. I really want, have you had any luck finding the JUN stuff? Not yet. I really wanna get a JUN lip or something like that, but it, oh my gosh, this thing is so nice. I love importing Japanese cars because there's always some surprises somewhere and it's just like, sometimes it's like weird for us here in America too because it's like it's a mix of two cultures. I'll see something and I'm like, what the hell is that? And then I'll find out, oh, that's what they use over there for blah, 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 blah. I'll save a lot of this for the detail video, but man, just look at how, that's pretty clean, that's pretty clean. I could probably go through and fix that up a little bit. Okay, I thought that was a diaper. STI seats. I don't even want to know how much these are worth. Okay, if this button works, it does. It does. It does work. I don't know. I'm not even you sure that. Out, you go out there, and we'll show you working. All right, let's do it. This was like the pinnacle. This is the beginning for Subaru Technica International. Oh. Okay. Well, when the hood's open, it sprays the you know the windshield, but really, it's supposed to. <laughs> It's supposed to spray that. Oh my gosh, dude. This thing's cool too. So you can tell it's got the EJ20G. I, I looked into this. Um, if it's got the slanted intercooler, uh, that's actually indic indicative that it is the EJ20G. Handcrafted and tuned by STI. It doesn't get too much cooler than this. Uh, and then you just see all of it, all of the, uh, the markings and stuff like that. Um, I guess that's when the uh, timing belt was yeah. changed last. I, my favorite angle. My favorite angle of this car is like the rear three quarters. This right here <laughs> is so freaking cool. And if you check out all these over here, these are some of the other cars that Oishi has. One thing I want to stress to you guys, and one thing I've always told you guys about imports, uh, it is really, really important to choose the right importer. Because there's a lot of sketchy ones out there, and there's a lot of crappy stuff that goes on behind the scenes, and people take your money, give you a crap car, they won't check the inspection sheets and stuff. It's not going to happen here. Jesse's awesome. I've worked with him before. Highly recommend it. But, uh, but you get the R33 GTR. Oh, I like this. Oh my god. I need to get these on my Skyline. The endless brakes. We're going to drive this real quick. And go say hi to a friend. Friend. Did you meet TJ? Yeah. The guy that was in my wedding? I don't think I ever with talked poofy, to him. With poofy fancy hair? Yeah, I don't think I ever talked to him. Okay. Well, we're about to go see his car. So is that. That's just cool. You think anything that has Japanese on it is, is cool? Yeah, I do. If I had Japanese on me, you would think I was cool. Maybe. I've ridden in the GTR. Oh, that sound. <laughs> oh! Buddy, God dang. This is the same car as my purple one. Except, yeah. except the coupe. How about the coupe? You're really making an entrance. <laughs> <laughs> Everyone's watching you. <laughs> like, like the whole well, squad. Well, I mean, this is like the brightest colored <laughs> R33 you can buy, so. <laughs> the whole squad. <laughs> hey, what happened to your roof, bro? How about your roof? Anyways, um, if you guys want to check out some more, Oishi, I have, uh, I'll put their Instagram page 
in the description. You guys can check them out. They are gonna update that and then also their site, they'll have the stuff on there. They are finishing out the inside right now and uh, it's a work in progress, but I guess the soft launch is there. You can still get cars from you guys and stuff right now. Yeah, so. our grand opening, we're hoping to be around August 15th next month. Cool. Uh, we're actually gonna be a full-time dealership and we're building a coffee shop in the lobby as well. Dude! So we're gonna hopefully host the monthly meets here. Yeah, like a like a like a backroom bourbon kind of thing. Yeah, too. yeah, yeah. No, we're gonna we're gonna have a, a private that's, club. That's what I'm talking yeah. about. <laughs> Last summer, you saw the clock on the wall. Where'd you find her? Where? You know she stands so tall, like a ghost in the night. But I don't wanna find a grandfather. You know you fight me. Peace out, Houston. It's been real. I didn't I didn't see any wire wheels, even though Jaren did, so I didn't get the full Houston experience. Boishi is actually going to be full opening, and uh, like they said, they're gonna start doing ho host meets and stuff like that, so I might actually come down for one of those meets. I guess just follow their page. Obviously follow my page too, because I will always let you guys know beforehand if I do come down uh, for a meet and greet. I know a lot of you guys in Houston are, are super wanting to meet me, and uh, I would love to meet you guys too. Make sure you follow my Instagram, and again, check out Weishi. If you are wanting to import a car, or just you just kinda wanna just look at cool cars, hit them up. From Dallas to Houston and back, and the sun is still shining. Oh, almost tripped. I've been in the car a long time. I think this car has coilovers, by the way. Yeah, it do. Got a spare 2JZ GTE, and also got my Skyline wheels dismounted to send them off. If you guys missed the last video, the bag video, we're gonna send those off, get them respect. One of the things that I'm gonna do first, what I have to do, what I always have to do, is detail. I'm fairly, I'm pretty highly confident I can make this paint look like normal paint again. You think I could do it? I'm fairly confident I can. So we're gonna take some griots to this and uh, make it look good again. That's my favorite thing ever. And then obviously we're gonna just do some simple mods and make this thing look dope. Not exactly sure what I wanna do. If I do wanna keep these wheels, I did notice that uh, these moddies are, yeah, this can probably be cleaned off, but not sure if they fit the style of the car perfectly. I'll do a bit of research. I'll get the right ones, don't worry. We'll make it cool, just like all the other stuff. It's like Jaren's Miata, this car, the Evo. I gotta make it look as cool as the Evo. Put them side by side one day and just have two revolutionary rally cars. This is seriously uh, the last car I will buy for a while. These last two purchases that I have made, the one that you guys don't know about yet, uh, and this car have been kind of like a why not sort of deal. This is a cooler version of the, the WRX that I bought. <laughs> These cars are just ones that I could not pass up. And uh, so we'll have a little bit of content with this one. I don't want you guys to think that I'm abandoning my other projects. We're, we're finishing all these. I've actually been paying somebody to work at my shop while I'm gone. So the whole day I was working, somebody was working here and helping me get some stuff done. So don't want you guys to think that I'm abandoning that stuff and I'm getting in over my head. I'm just kind of investing and um, buying things as I can, when I can, while I can, before they get super expensive. There you have it. This is my one of 200 made of this run version one Subaru STI as a wagon. It's the coolest thing ever. Had to jump on this deal, could not resist. If you're new to the channel, I give daily advice every day. And I want you guys to know that uh, each day you're presented with a choice. No matter what happens, no matter how bad life is and no matter how good life is, no matter how many cars you have or don't have, no matter how much money you do or don't have, you're presented with a choice of thankfulness or ungratefulness. Literally everybody can be whiny and complaining. If you don't get rid of that habit now, it will stick with you for ever, no matter how successful you ever become. If you begin to practice gratefulness and thankfulness now, even for the smallest of things, you won't believe how much it will impact you later in life. If you start valuing the small things in life, you won't even be able to comprehend how great 
the big things will feel. And if you don't get rid of that bad attitude, it'll stay with you forever, no matter how many cars you have, no matter how much this or that, whether you're married, single, whatever it is, it'll haunt you and it'll stay with you forever. Create good habits today. Have an amazing one. Catch you guys in the next video. Peace. Hey, by the way, make sure you hit subscribe, right? Yeah, we're gonna do that. Hit subscribe and make sure there's notifications on. Also, I have two videos in front of you to watch. Please watch them, it helps me out a ton. Hope you guys have a wonderful day.